Fred here, welcome back to the Gear Obsession channel. In this episode, we'll be taking a look at the JAM Trance Mini Bluetooth Speaker. Well, I'm going to try to transport you back into the 70s when we had light organs <laughs> and then bring you back to the future and incorporate that into this little miniature Bluetooth speaker. Isn't that cool? Um, I, I'm just all 70s out, or actually this is 60s, but um, actually all of this is 60s, but I don't remember back that far. <laughs> but uh, it's funny, when I was coming home from work today, I got behind this car. Um, I'll take a little bit uh, closer look, and it's a Bronco. Um, how long has it been since you've seen a Bronco? But the really strange thing was that inside that Bronco was this dude with long hair and a ponytail, young guy, jamming out on rock and roll in his Bronco, and it like took me back. It was like someone just teleported this person from the 70s right in front of me. It was really weird. And uh, it, it sort of leads into this video right here, because same, you know, light organs and, and cool looking speakers and things like that. Um, this this is just cool, and it's really really cheap. There are some Bluetooth speakers out there that run almost two hundred dollars that do the little light show, but of course they'll sound better. But this is by Jam, and Jam um, has had Bluetooth speakers out for quite a long time, and they probably most known for those ones that are sort of a half can looking thing, and you could get two that pair and all that, and they do sound pretty good. So when I saw this made by that company. Um, seemed to be really nice uh, build quality, pretty solid, nice uh, rubberized coating, lots of buttons, lots of lights that I like. And I tested out the audio, you know, and I thought it sounded pretty good and well worth 40 bucks. So here we are. Let's take a close look. By the way, I picked this up in Target, um, also Walmart on um, their website at least lists it and they're all the same price thirty nine dollars ninety nine cents I'm just calling it forty dollars and I'm sure you'll you'll come across some sales there but it does have a aux in an auxiliary port or you could use Bluetooth it could be used as a speaker folks as a microphone five hours of play time with three hours of charge time and it gives you a little light show um, on the back it um, will give you like you, you could mess around with the buttons and come up with about 36 different LED program light show thingies Bluetooth rechargeable speakerphone and it has voice prompts where it sort of talks to you and it comes pre-charged out of the box um, how much is it pre-charged all depends on how long it's sitting on the shelf um, here's the speaker right there really nice by the way in the blue box that's also included in the case you get this little um, USB charging cable, micro USB on one side, USB on the other. Rather short cable there. Um, you also get a little warranty and safety brochure there. You get some instructions, which I'm going to be referencing here during the review. And you also get this guy right here, this little metal tool here that you could sort of poke in a hole somewhere in here. Right there, there's a little hole. You can see there's a little language symbol right there, sort of. And that will change the language that this does, that it talks to you, because it does voice prompts. So you could change it um, from English, Spanish, French, Portuguese, or just a tone if you don't want your electronic device to talk to you. <laughs> so I've already um, Bluetooth paired it with my cell phone that I have here. Because, uh, quite frankly, if you don't know how to pair um, devices in the Bluetooth world in this day and age, Maybe you just uh, <laughs> shouldn't buy the speaker. Um, uh, well, whatever. I'm not going there. So I'm going to go ahead and turn this on. You have uh, a bunch of buttons here on the top. I'll tell you what. I should show you the device here first. This is the front. This is where the sound comes out. These are where you can also see the light show. Um, this side, you just got the Jam logo right there. On this side, under this flap, you have the charging port right there, you have the auxiliary port right there, and again there's the little hole to change the voice prompts. And you can close that up, and it sort of keeps it pretty well weatherproof. Um, I don't know if it's waterproof or not, I don't see anything where it says, but I could be mistaken. Now you have these controls on the top, very hard to see what's going on there, but you do have a uh, power button also on top there's a light intensity button which is this um, little 
star thing right there. You also have the stop button right there. No, I'm mistaken. That is the color select button, that square. Um, this button right here with the little dots going in an angle. That is your program selector for the different light show programs. On off button right there. You also have this uh, minus and plus here. So for short presses, it's going to just sort of bring the audio level up and down, and long press uh, will advance or go back on your tracks. And then you have your stop or play and, and pause button right there in the middle. Uh, this little hole here, that's your microphone, so you can use it as a speakerphone. Back, there's nothing. So let's go ahead and start her up. I'm going to go ahead and press the power button, press and hold it. Powering on. And if you couldn't hear that, it said it was powering on. And it does a little light show. And it should tell you it's paired. Did it say it was paired? <laughs> Is my cell phone even odd? Of course these things never go as scheduled. Yeah, it's already paired. All right. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is just uh, play with it right here. Just sort of cycle through the different um, light shows and things like that. Well, it's uh, playing free music that I got off of YouTube that's uh, free use. And I'm just hitting that program, light program button there. I kind of like this one because it really goes to the music. You can see that square button, it just changes the colors. So you can make it all a single color, cycle through. Or you can make it the multi-colors um, at some point right there. Hold on, I'll find it. Or maybe not. <laughs> Um, also, you could change the intensity of the light. Remember I told you there was that button right there in the middle? It looks like a, a shout or something. You can make it dimmer, 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 or off. And then bring it back to full. And again, you could go through the different light shows there. And again, you can hit the different colors. So you can see all kinds of choices there. That's my favorite right there, multicolor, and it's sort of like an equalizer. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, advance. So remember I told you you can press and hold the plus button, let's say, to advance to the next track. So you don't have to grab your cell phone and do it, you can do it right here on the speaker. Audio quality is actually quite good. Now it doesn't have extraordinary bass, but um, it's pretty good for what it is. For the size and the price, it is really good audio. So there you go. Um, if you want to turn it off, just press and hold the power button. Press and hold it a little bit longer than I just did. <laughs> powering off. Let you know it's powering off, and there it is. So build quality, um, it feels really, really good. So again, um, it will play for five hours, 
um, and that's on three hours of charging so that's uh, pretty good you get more time out of it than you're you're putting in so I'll tell you I think this is a pretty groovy speaker um, if you want something a little bit bigger there is the Jam Trance not the Trance Mini the Trance it's bigger I think it's about eighty dollars um, this I think this is perfect just to carry along have your little pocket light organ uh, right there it, it's fun it's cool it's only forty bucks it matches my shirt <laughs> and I highly recommend it there's uh, not much not to like as a matter of fact I don't think I really found anything that I dislike about it I just love it I just I'll tell you I wish it had more patterns that went more with the music um, they don't all seem to totally go with the music they just sort of look random I don't know if they are going to the music or not but um, some do some don't but um, uh, just way freaking cool the only other criticism I could find is the the USB cable is really short and it doesn't come with a with a pow little power brick but these days I think everybody has some sort of charger so longer cable maybe some more patterns that go with music is my only criticisms everything else I love and it's an outstanding buy for the price as far as uh, links below um, right now Amazon is not selling it so you know I'll put a, a link to Amazon but it's probably gonna say they're not in stock but maybe one day they'll populate and you'll click on it and something will be there for now you know I guess go to um, Walmart or um, where I got it at, at Target because they have them there and I believe they also have them on their websites if you want to go there. Okay, well thank you very much for joining me here at the Gear Obsession channel. I really appreciate every friend, viewer, subscriber and especially you and I hope you have a groovy day. Take care. Bye.